Hi, in this video, I'm going to talk about the BizDoc NAS ultimate capability to GAC and ungac DLLs in an easy way. We all know in BizDoc, at some point, you might have to GAC the DLLs in order to deploy them or to make them available for the BizDoc runtime to process. While developing, you will often need to GAC and ungac DLLs for testing purposes and for making sure that they are available for BizDoc. And so you oftentimes have to manually GAC those DLLs by using the command line and using GAC Util to deploy, verify if the DLLs are correctly deployed. What we built in BizDoc NAS Ultimate is the ability to quickly do it. And so what we can do is we can go into the BizDoc NAS menu at the project level and click register in GAC or unregister from GAC. And so I'm going to quickly use the register from GAC to GAC this project DLL. And as you can see, I got a, um, a message telling me that you must run Visual Studio as an administrator to be able to uh, perform the GAC operation. So I'm going to switch to a elevated Visual Studio window where I will now try and do it again. And so I can go now and register GAC in the DLL and we can see now it has been correctly deployed. We can actually run this uh, GAC Util list command to verify that we have this DLL uh, actually correctly deployed. If we switch back, we could, might want to undeploy a DLL uh, from the system, and so as quickly you can go and unregister the GAC from the DLL, and so it is now gone, and if we run the query, you can see that no items that match this DLL are actually present in the GAC. And this is all from GACing and ungacking DLLs in BizTalk NAS Ultimate.